Hi, my name is Jason, and on this week's Technique of the Week, we're going to be talking about when you have something like this, uh, where you're buttoning up two slabs together, where you're pouring one pour and another pour. We have a lot of this at our shop because we're, we're constantly adding sections. So today we're going to show you when you have something like this, you know, what happens is in the winter, you got the freeze and thaw. So these two kind of raise up, and it wants to chip off the edge of the next one here. So. Today's technique, we're going to be um, you know, showing you that, showing you uh, a simple thing to do there uh, to, to prevent that. So stay tuned right here on DecoCrete TV. So these are what our slabs look like typically when we're pouring uh, out here at our DecoCrete shop in Orville. And this is kind of how we do it. We use these speed dials, which are, are really cool. Ch check those out if you haven't seen those. It's a real easy way to dial, you know, into concrete without having to, I hate running drills, you know, because it takes a lot longer. It's so much easier just to put these in. So we're dialing into this slab. Obviously we want to hold them together. I don't want to put expansion joint there uh, between them because that would just make a, you know, even wider gaps uh, in these. And that even gives them more chance to move around. So. By tying them together, we make sure that they're all, you know, kind of doing the same thing. The only bad thing is, like I showed up there, uh, when they move a little bit, sometimes, you know, you get that. So typically this is how, how we're, we're tying it together. So here we are at our slab. We just poured this yesterday, poured this uh, two days ago, and this one we poured yesterday. So now we have this uh, joint here where we edged on both sides. Uh, so the next thing we're going to do is just run our saw through there. It's a simple technique. We're going to cut right there. We're not cutting down where we're going through the rebar. I mean, I know those are down about an inch and a half to two inches. So I'm just going to cut down uh, about an inch deep through here. And that just gives that little bit of relief uh, in the winter. So when it moves, it helps so they don't, they don't bust like that. And uh, ever since we've been doing that on these slabs, uh, that's, that's really helped a lot. So thanks so much for joining us this week on Technique of the Week, man. We appreciate all you guys watching our, our videos and stuff, and, and uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks.